Today's game is being played in Newson Stadium, home of the Nashville Lycans. A lot of great music clubs in Nashville, Bricks. Yeah, I went to a country star Dar Crooks' place last night. It was like half dead. It was only 9 o'clock. It's a zombie joint, you idiot. Of course it was half dead. And today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams are taking the field. The Snuffle Thrills battle. The Nashville Lycans. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. <laughs> and MFL Game Day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow and my partner Brickhead Mulligan and Mini Bricks. Heard you got a little touch of the mutant bird and pig flu. How you feeling, partner? Well, uh, the projectile vomiting finally let up, but uh, the monsoon mudslide would be done. <laughs> if you know what I mean. I've been, oh. I've been literally cramping his brains out all night. He's getting stupider by the hour, if that's even possible. <laughs> the burn returner was maimed by the so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> Straight through the uprights. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. And he just used his beat. Oh, welcome to Fumbletown, USA. Population, this guy. Well, he should be more careful when he hurdles. And it's first and ten. They're taking what the defense has given them. That's a four-yard gain on the reception. Hey, less than a wife with a headache. Second down and six. Oh, the defender almost picked off the ball on that one. Third down and six. It's a good interception. What's that, Grim? A fabulous interception. didn't see it. At least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. And it's first and ten. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay him for the pick six. For this, you just give them a pat on the head and tell them they don't suck. Second down and ten. Huh? 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 down! I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. It's first and ten. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was in school. Yeah. Oh, man, he just got skewered by those spikes. That was bloody and disgusting. Hey, anyone in the mode for stake? Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. <laughs> 
And it's first and ten. And he was stuck to him like glue. Second down and ten. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. And this guy couldn't hit the side of a fallout shelter. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named his clothing company Lukewarm Threads. Team hates it. And it's first and ten. And the QB might as well just bury himself. I hope you covered your ears, Rick, because that was a sonic blast dirty trick. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, Who's next? <laughs> <laughs> and it's first and ten. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. Second down and seven. Oh, the unstoppable force meets the explodable object. Oh, so close, but not today. You gotta be fucking kidding me. If that's a penalty, they should come up here and penalize us, too. Hey, hey don't give these refs any ideas, you idiot. Friend, I just dash. On it. Second down and long. And the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Second down in a mile. Catch for a 10 yard gain. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. And the defense gave up a lot of yards on that pass play. They'll need to regroup quickly. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. And that punter gets paid way too much to kick like that. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. And it's first and ten. It's a six-yard gain. And that'll be second down and four. He might have managed 
to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better, like Eskimos burying salmon heads, kimchi. No matter if anything really tastes good. Hit that line the way a Republican congressman hits. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, Grim. And it's first and ten. The defender says, I don't think so. Second down and ten. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're going to dump his ass. Third down and, well, good luck. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Hey, Tim, what if interceptions counted as touchdown? Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. And it's first to ten. Knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. Second down and two. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a convalescent home. And it's first and ten. in his path, and the body toll continues to climb. The offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, Wim, they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. I don't think the funeral expenses, that is. Second down, and ain't gonna happen, partner. Right, the QB is going to have more interceptions than completions. Oh, that was a hit. You ever had your lights knocked out like that, Bricks? I'll take the salad, Steve. Wait, where am I? And it's first and ten. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? We've got a tight battle here as quarter one comes to an end. Second down and a very lot. And he's off to the races. The 20, and they're catching up. Joke, job, go shopping. Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I gotta see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. Boom! Oh man, he just killed that guy when the play was over. Well, if the rep didn't see it, at least the mortician did. He's coming out in the field now. Second and one. And the 
quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his Brilinis this morning. That, my friends, was an all-pro with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. And it's first and ten. Oh. He just put that guy out of his misery and says, who's next? Second down, the size of Brick's wiener. Hey! Sorry, partner. Hey, man, I was hanging on the piano now. They all have... <laughs> Third down and nine. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Ham sandwiches. I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? Yeah, still working on my slimy here, Briggs. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. The offense has only one quarterback left. If he dies, it's game over. Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? It's good. <laughs> They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. This guy's a brick shithouse. And it's first and ten. Second down in a lot. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him? Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, good night to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. And it's first and ten. Destruction in his path. The defense comes up with the ball. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. And it's first and ten. Knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. Second down and five. Is he dead? Uh, nah, he's still moving. Crap, I have money on him biting the big one. If he don't die soon, my loan shark is gonna kill me. And four. Oh. If there were any oh, holy smokes, he just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the MFL. Yeah. And the offense has only two running backs left.
left, and the defense is licking their lips. Uh, I think they want to hit those last two runners for this outfit. And it's first and ten. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Down there like, bam! Oh, man, that's the end of his day. He might want to try hurling those traps next. Nestor Likens were neutered today in a devastating loss by forfeit. Yeah, what's left of them is walking off the field with their tails between their legs. And that guy's carrying his tail. Oh, my God, ripped off. They battled hard but didn't have enough to get it done. They choked like a bunch of banana choking chimp chumps choking on a bag of chimp dicks. Did you just say choking on a bag of chimp dicks? Yeah. Yeah, that's beautiful. Today's game was brought to you by Comcrack Entertainment. They're not happy until you're not happy.